um, to see something that's well over 6,000 years old, it's, um, it's not a way to really put that into words. The feeling of being there and seeing those things and to imagine that there were people actually, you know, there painting and, and eating and hunting and doing, you know, guarding their territory. It's, it's, I can't really say that the, it's sunk in to see that and just to know that 6,000 years ago there were, there were people there. Some of the areas that they painted were so high just you can imagine they must have been like 15 feet tall or something to be able to reach some of those areas. Uh, one of the areas that we went to, it looked like they had they had dug in, dug out an area so that they could see through, see over the land. So when someone was telling us that a guard was there, you know, once long ago was there watching over the land because it was this uh, area where you could just see all around. Um, just, we have so much to learn from these paintings. There's uh, paintings of cows. It looks like there are people, um, they say they were worshiping the cows. There were dogs, images of dogs near uh, lots of the, the shapes of men. So you know that they were, it was a time that they were domesticated, uh, these caves in the paintings are from the Neolithic period. And so that was a time where people were domesticating um, sheep, dogs, and uh, sheep, do sheep, dogs, and animals like that. So to see the paintings with the people with those animals is, is amazing. Uh, some of the images had, had cows with some sort of a, like a cloth, like a decorative cloth around them. And there were there were images of people holding their hands up, so yeah, I guess they were worshiping. Uh, we even you know you can still find different artifacts around, such as this, where you can tell you can tell someone you know used another rock and just cut right through it for hunting or <laughs> shaving. Try to find out more information on these places. It's fun. Um, just sink in. <laughs> it's just—it's amazing to be here, and I'm so glad that.